Hi, Intuitive D1111 here. My name is Diana. Thank you so much for joining me. This is going to be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, all love message video. I'm going to see what comes through here. I'm using the Romance Dating um, Sex and Love deck from Soul Magic 99. So, how's your love interest feeling for you right now, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Okay, so it says getting to know each other. We have <laughs> seduce him in the bedroom. Okay, so their mind is already going there. Okay, all right for Cancer Sun. Maybe they're um, maybe they're just planning what it is that they want to do with you. Look at this <laughs> dress, sexy for date night. Okay, so I don't know if this is what they want to do or maybe something that they've seen you do already. But either way. Yeah, they want to get to know you, but they're also thinking about other things, too. <laughs> new home. Some of them are picturing having a new home with you, and then they want all this to happen. <laughs> That's funny. That's kind of in reverse. Okay. All right. How is your love interest feeling for you, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus? Let's see what messages come through for Cancer. What else? They're kind of spicy already. All right. Let's see. We have soulmate love. That's beautiful. So it's not just, you know, all the passion. It's it's more than that. And then we <laughs> and then back to it, right? We have lazy sun Sunday all day in bed. <laughs> Pleasuring each other. Okay, cancer. And then um this connection is going to cause you to look within. So it's a soul searching connection, but I, I see this as the Herman card. So this actually could be someone that maybe you're not even talking to right now, but little do you know, um, <laughs> this is everything that they're thinking about with you, right? Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and use the, where is it at? Oh yes, here we go. So I'm going to use the Hidden Truth Oracle, the first volume, and the Love Message Oracle cards from Actions Intuitive. Go ahead and see how your love interest feels for you, Cancer. This is for Cancer. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. How your love interest is feeling for you. All right, let's see here. All right. So how's the love interest for cancer feeling for them right now? What do they need to know? It says decision. So it's time to decide about this relationship. So maybe that's what they're doing while they're going within, right? What else? How's the love interest for cancer feeling for them? We have a flyer and it says, I hope that you can forgive me one day. Okay. So they are reflecting right now, and they're realizing, you know what, that there's things they did that they shouldn't have done, right? And then we have, finding out the truth crushed me. So someone found out something in this connection, and it was just, it was like mind blown, right? It was like, what? All right, what else? How is it of interest for cancer feeling for them? Okay, we have boundaries, firm boundaries are needed now. So I feel like there's an energy block. I feel like there's not, um, you know, it's, it's like when there's wounds within a connection and you're both still healing, so there's not really, it's, it's like you're walking on a street, but there's potholes, right? It's like they haven't been filled in yet. <laughs> I don't know what type of analogy that is, but that's what I'm seeing. Like someone walking down a street and, you know, they have to kind of like tiptoe, right? It's like they don't want to fall into the pothole because it has not been filled and cleared yet. So there's definitely still some killing. Um, that's why your person's going within. And then we have, I knew exactly what I was doing. Now, for some of you, I feel like maybe, um, because this seems like a person that has a lot of fiery energy, so maybe maybe this is what got them in trouble, <laughs> right? Just kind of automatically having their mind go here and here and here and kind of rushing things as opposed to, you know, taking the time to, you know, really get to know, get to know you or get to know you more, right? Because we change over time. But they love you. Look at that. Bottom of the deck. I love you. So that's beautiful right there. All right. So they're, right now they're deciding what it is that they want to do. 
Okay, let's see. Let's get more messages here. Let me see which deck I'm going to use. I'm going to go ahead and use this here. This is the Twin Flame Journey Messages, the second volume for Mystic Moon Oracles. So, love messages for Cancers. How's our love interest feeling for them? Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you like this video, how's our love interest feeling for them? Oh. Goodness, they got all kind of stuff that just wants to fly out. Do I want to take them all? All right. Your person has a lot to say, which means they've probably not been communicating as much with you. So they're holding it all inside, right? It says, I just got sidetracked. So this could be a part. Maybe that's why this decision is here is because this person is like heavily influenced um, by outside, by outside factors. And then we have... I'm still haunted by my actions. So I don't know what they did, but, you know, if they got caught up. They are really regretting that. It says you've affected my life significantly. So they really want you to know that. So even if they are not, you know, being open and vulnerable, and that's still what they're thinking. And then we have the thought of you still does things to me. Yeah, we can definitely see that up top here with that entire first row. And then I've thought about reaching out to you, but then I stopped myself. So yeah, right now I think they feel like there needs to be some space for healing. And then we have, it all comes down to timing. So those are the messages that I have for you, Cancer. Thank you so much for um, watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button for me and um, subscribe if you feel led to. And if no one has told you yet today, I love you and you are amazing. Thank you so much for joining me. Okay, bye-bye.